the very first session of Python programming. We'll introduce some basic features of Python programming in this tutorial. So let's begin. First we'll look at the list of programming languages. In this world we have lots of programming languages made for special purpose just like .NET, C and Haskell, Java. There are many more great languages but why Python is made that's what we're gonna figure out in this tutorial so Python is easy to learn and use Python is really easy to write code inspect understand and use the rapid development in the recent years of Python have made it more possible for the new beginners to use it Google and even great biggies like Twitter great APIs from the world has been written in Python. Python documentation provided by python.org is really great. It's make it a cool language to understand. It has large set of modules and Python is cross-platform. Along with that, Python is multi-paradigm that you can use procedural oriented programming in Python. You can use object oriented programming in Python and many more like functional, or mathematical implementation or logical programming all this you can use in Python programming now there's some completely different verses that comes from the dis different aspects of the programming world about Python like from Larry Wall Peter Norwick that inspires someone to use Python quickly Python is awarded a fan favorite language for the year 2010 or 27 2007 and many more awards as well so why should I code in Python what make it different than other programming languages it's code really sensibly it's code we are looking at here this is the programming code of a C for a hello world program it's look pretty much it's roughly more line code after that coming to C++ the code remains almost same some readability came in Java but it's not as good as we wanted so guess what would be the hello world program for Python this should be the standard title for the hello world program and look at the program it's just like the title it's nothing else so what we wanted we just coded it with efficient amount of code that we understand and make others to understand so this is the specialty I feel Python has so let's begin with using some Python so you can begin using Python on your Linux terminal by typing Python and it opens up the Python interpreter so the very first command will run on Python is print hello visitors now as you can see it is interpreting the line by line so when I hit enter it just prints out hello comma visitors now there are more best means of Python if you are declaring a variable like v is equals to 12 you do not need to specify what type of variable you are declaring is it int is it float or anything else you don't need to specify it gets specified at the dynamic time so when I hit enter 12 value is automatically assigned to v so when I print v this is 12 a better means also comes in your browser to use Python if you do not want or just want to have a quick hand on Python you can use python anywhere.com this is a great site to begin your consoles of Python online and just you can share with others also so if I type here some more commands like a is equal to 12.3 and print a it's getting pretty more better 
Now, when I talk about the documentation of Python, it's look quite in this way. So I can read all about what's new in Python 2.7, how it is better than Python 2.6. I get all the informations about the Python implementations. Also, PEPs. So if I use this, you can see how well the documentation is written along with the code snippet. You can also search along the code snippet, the search bar, print in Python. And a bit of trouble with an internet speed. And it does shows how command line works in all flex. So this was the simple presentation, the first ever presentation of Python programming language from my side. Thanks for watching.